Good morning, early start. Good afternoon, early start. Good morning, early start. Good afternoon, early start. How do you do today? How are you? And how are you? Well, how are you today? Well, I hope your hands are nice and clean. We're keeping our fingers away from our eyes, our noses and our mouths. Uh, coughing into our elbows, tissues in the bin when we're outside. Uh, with our mummies or daddies or our brothers or sisters that we stay back from people who aren't in our live in our houses uh, and we don't want anybody to get any nasty coughs and sneezes now remember we were talking about this shape this is my tin of tomatoes what shape was it it had a circle on the top and a circle on the bottom and the sides are round can you remember what shape it is hmm? can you remember a it had three sounds in the word, three sounds. It is a cylinder, very good, a cylinder. Now, a cylinder is a circled flat top, a circle flat on the bottom there, a flat circle on the bottom. It slides around, so when it's done, it can slide. And when you put it on its side, it can roll, very good. That was a cylinder. This is also a cylinder, and these were cylinders. And you remember I found lots of other little things that were cylinders. I'm sure you could find some of those, or maybe you did find them in your house. And then we have this shape here, remember this? Now, this is not a circle, no. This had a, this shape here, do you remember? It was a square, a square, very good. A square on the top, and a square everywhere. And what is the name of the shape? Can you remember what the name of the shape was? It is a, what is it? It's a, one sound, a, a, yeah, a cube, a cube. And then we found this one here. Uh, remember, this is a little dice from my game. It is a uh, dice, it is also a cube. There it is, it's a square on the top, and a square everywhere. And then this was a box here, is a cube, because it is a square on the top, and a square everywhere, very good. And then this one is uh, has a square on it, hasn't it? Yes, and this is another cube, because when I turn it around, it's a square. Ooh, no, 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 hang on a second, it's not a square everywhere, look. It's a square there, but not here. It's a square here, but not here. What? But so this is a different shape. It's not a cube. A cube is a square everywhere. This is not a square everywhere. It has a square there, but look, it has this shape as well at the side. Can you see? Oh, it's the wrong way around. I'll show you. There, look at that. That is a a rectangle, a rectangle, a rectangle. So we have a square here and a rectangle here, which means, well, it's not a square everywhere, so it can't be a cube. So what shape do you think this packet of crackers is? Hmm? Well, it's called a cuboid, a what? A cuboid, it has two sounds, cuboid. This is a cube, cube. This is a cuboid, cuboid, cube, cuboid, cube, cuboid. Go away. So let's have a little look at the cuboid and what makes it that shape. Well, let's think about it. Okay, now I'm gonna put my hand on this side here and I'm gonna put my hand on the other side, except I'm going to use another word. Listen carefully to the word I'm going to use. So I'm gonna put one hand on this side and I'm going to put this hand on the opposite. Here's a big word, opposite side. So this here is one side and this hand is on the opposite side. I'm going to lift it up carefully and turn it around. So you can see the square is on this end and there is a square on the opposite end. And that means that those two sides, they are the same size. This one here is the same size as this one here. So if I turn my uh, packet of crackers on my cuboid on its side like this, I put one hand here, and I put one hand, excuse me, on the opposite side, and up there, so one hand is on this side and one hand is on the opposite side. I'm going to lift it up carefully and look. So this side here is the same size as the opposite side. Ooh, that's interesting. This one here is the same size as the opposite side. And if I stand, stand it like this, one hand on this side and one hand over and on the opposite side. So there you are, this is one side, this is the opposite side. And this side is the same size as the opposite side. Now that's important to remember. So here's another one I found, another box now. There's a good clue. Think of the word box. So this is going to, this box is a cuboid, 
Okay, now it has a rectangle here and a rectangle over here, but look very carefully. If I put one hand on this side here, right, and put one hand on the opposite side and lift it up carefully, I can see that where my hands are, so this is one side, my fingers, and there's the other side, these, this side here, is the same size as the opposite side. Look at that. Ooh, I'm going to do it here again. So this side here, I'm going to lift my hand over and push it over here. So this hand on this side here, I'm going to lift this hand over and put it on that side there. And I'm going to lift it up carefully. And we can see that this side here is the same size as this side over here. They're the same size. So even if I turn it this way, right? There we are. And I'm going to put one hand on this side here. Okay, I'm gonna lift my hand over here and put it on the opposite side, on the opposite side, and I'll just turn around so you can see. So that side there is the same size as that side there. Now I know this side has a picture of a phone on it, and this one doesn't, but the opposite sides, they're the same size. Mmm, a box. So think of that word box. Here's another box. You know this box, in this box, I was in the supermarket and I got this box. It's custard. So I just do it like that. And I'm going to put one hand on this side here and put one hand on the opposite side and we lift it up and we look carefully. Yep, we can see that the sides that are opposite are the same size. So if we do it this way again, so I put one hand on this side and one hand over here on the opposite side. I lift it up carefully and I check. Yep, the sides that are opposite are the same size. So let me do it this way. So one hand on this side and one hand on the opposite side and lift it up and check and we can see that the sides that are opposite are the same size. So this is a cuboid. Now, it doesn't matter how small or big they are. Uh, again, think of this. Look, here is a box of tea bags. There's that word again, box. Good clue for a cuboid. So let's see, let's check. The sides that are opposite have to be the same size. Hmm. So I'm going to put one hand on this side, put one hand oh, over here on the opposite side. Okay, stop. I'm going to lift it up carefully and we can see that this, this side here, yeah, is the same size as the opposite side. Look at that. So if I just turn my uh, box of tea bags that way and I'm going to put one hand on this side and lift this hand over here and put it on that side. Okay, stop. Uh, and we lift it up carefully and we can see that this side here is, I'm checking, is the same size as that side over there. The opposite side is the same size. And I can even try it this way, so it's nice and tall. This side here, and look over the top onto the opposite side. And I turn it around, you can see that this side here is the same size as the opposite side. So that is a cuboid box, a box. Very good. Now, I just want to show you one more thing as well. Now, look at this. This is a box of tomatoes. Oh, I bought tomatoes as well. I bought a box of tomatoes. I moved it in a bit. And I also bought a tin of tomatoes. We like tomatoes in this house. So there's a tin of tomatoes, a cylinder, and this box here of tomatoes is a cuboid. Okay. Now, uh, yeah, so we have... Let's just check this. Let's put one hand on this side here and put one hand on the opposite side. Lift it up. Okay, and the sides that are opposite. Yep, they're the same size. Let's try it this way. Put my hand on one side. Put my hand on the opposite side. Lift it up and I'm checking. Yep, the same size. I'm going to turn it on its side like that. One hand on this side. Oh, we go on this side and check. Yep, this, they're all the same. Yep, the sides that are opposite are the same size. The sides that are opposite they are the same size. Very good. So I can buy tomatoes in a cuboid or a cylinder. Now a cylinder can slide and a cuboid can slide. A cylinder can roll. I hope it comes back. But a cuboid, it can't roll. It can only slide. It can never roll. It can only slide. None of the cuboids can roll, they can only slide. slide. So it doesn't matter what side you put them on, they can slide, but they never can roll. Oh, poor hell. Now, none of them can. This one, look, it can slide, 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 but it can never roll. Very good. 
So, uh, and this one again, look at this one here. They can slide, 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 but it can never roll. Now, remember what we said also, the word box. This is a box, and this is a box here, look. So, boxes uh, are always cuboids. Every box you see would always be a cuboid. And actually, if it's a box, it's a cuboid, and it kind of looks a bit like uh, a block. Remember the blocks we used to, the blocks we used to build with in the early start? They were cuboids. So we can build them. So they look like a box, or they look like a block. Very good. So let's have a little think about that now. So while we're doing that, I'm going to show you a little song, or teach you a little song about cuboids. Yeah? Uh, and it'll help us remember what a cuboid is. So here we go. One, two, three. A cuboid, a cuboid, it looks like a box. Yep. A cuboid, a cuboid, it looks like a block. Yep. The sides that are opposite are the same size. We checked that, we did. And it never rolls, it only slides. Okay, let's listen to that again. So we check again. Remember here is a cuboid. Okay, so a cuboid, a cuboid, it looks like a box. Yep. A cuboid, a cuboid, it looks like a block. Yep. The sides that are opposite are the same size. Well, let's check that again, remember? The sides that are opposite are the same size. The sides that are opposite are the same size. Yep. And it never rolls, it only slides. And it never rolls, it only slides. It never rolls, it only slides. Slides, very good for so my cue boys. And we can sing the cue boy song. Maybe you can join in with me. One, two, three, four. A cue boy, a cue boy, it looks like a box. A cue boy, a cue boy, it looks like a block. The sides that are opposite are the same size. And we check that, and it never rolls, it only slides. A cuboid, a cuboid, it looks like a box. A cuboid, a cuboid, it looks like a block. The sides that are opposite are the same size. And it never rolls, it only slides. Very good. So we have it, a cuboid, a cuboid, it looks like a box. A cuboid, a cuboid, it looks like a block. The sides that are opposite are the same size and it never rolls, it only slides. Very good. Now maybe you can go checking in your house for some cuboids. And remember, anything that is a box is really a cuboid. So, and they look like blocks. And maybe you could build something with them. Now remember, before you start going looking for anything, will you check with your mommy or your daddy and don't be climbing into presses and taking things out that your mommy doesn't know about because she'll go crazy and then she'll have a... She, she, she'll call me a noob to that Terry fella telling you to do stupid things. So make sure you check and see, can you find some cuboids, okay? Now, that's great. So look, happy cuboid hunting. I hope you get on well and uh, I might talk to you again later on. If I don't, I'll see you all tomorrow, okay? Goodbye and remember, you're all noodles.